Ladies and gentlemen, it's Mike and Max, and we're back with seven high dividend paying stocks that'll boost your passive income portfolio. While researching, we've looked for not only high dividend yields and consistent payouts, but also sound financials with great returns over the last five years. Some of the main factors we focused on are earnings, cash flow, and debt ratio. We also looked for good margins, which helps ensure companies can continue to provide dividend returns for years to come. You don't have to be a technical analysis doctor to give a company a solid checkup before investing. Of course, never buy a stock because a couple of guys on YouTube told you to. Always do thorough research before spending your hard-earned money. If this video helps you out in any way, hit the like button and subscribe. Without further ado, let's get right into it. The first two picks on our list aren't the greenest companies as they do center around the fossil fuel industry. But don't forget, the US is still 60% reliant on fossil fuels, and let's be honest, electric car owners still have to charge their vehicles somehow. Let's kick off our high dividend stocks with Canadian energy giant Enbridge, ticker ENB. The company based in oil rich Alberta currently transports 25% of the crude oil and 20% of the natural gas consumed in North America. Traded on both the New York Stock Exchange and the Toronto Stock Exchange, its current share price is around $40 with a 52 week range between about $28 and $43. The year to date return is over 34% and the company has had a three year total return of over 46%, but that's not why they made our list. Max, give them some of those dividend details. The current yield is over 6%, which is paid quarterly. The company has had a compound dividend growth rate of over 10% for the last 26 years. Not just that, revenue, gross margin, and cash flow are all positive, and the company is seen as an industry leader in its sector. They continue to beat earnings, and many analysts have them as a buy. Couple that with a strong dividend history, excellent yield, and return on investment, and we recommend checking them out for yourself. You know we love our Canadian investments, eh? Yeah. Yeah. The next pick on our list has been delivering fossil fuels in the US for over 130 years, which is older than the NFL. Sunoco, ticker SUN, like Enbridge, is enjoying some awesome growth recently with a year-to-date return of over 50% and a five-year total return of over 189%. The share price is around $40 and it has a 52-week range between $27 and $42. The dividend yield is over 8% and they've had a strong history of dividend distribution over the last decade. Even when the share price faltered in 2020 with the economic slowdown, they had consistent dividend returns thanks to their excellent solvency and efficiency. Positive cash flow and continued growth make this dividend stock an easy choice for steady, high dividend yields. As NASCAR's official race fuel since 2004, Sunoco might just be the high octane stock you need to fuel your dividend portfolio on race day. That was cheesy. Yeah, it was. Uh, moving on, we have BlackRock TCP Capital Corp. Ticker TCPC. Classified as a financial specialty lending company, this is yet another high dividend paying stock with outstanding gains over the last five years. You won't hear much about them in the news or media. They fly under the radar for the most part, which is hard to believe when you look at their return on investment. With a share price of only about $13 or the price of two Big Macs, this stock is very affordable. After the 2020 dip, they've recovered nicely with a year-to-date return of over 30%. Pair that with their dividend yield of just under 9%, which hasn't missed a return for investors since 2012, and you get the best of both worlds. It has a PE ratio of 5.25 and a trailing 12-month earnings per share of 258. TCP Capital isn't as sexy as Tesla, but with strong financials and excellent returns, this stock checks all the boxes if you're looking for a high dividend yield close to 9%. And next up, we have Alliance Bernstein Holding LP, ticker AB. This investment company aims to service both high net worth and retail clients. They have an excellent dividend track record since the late 80s, and better yet, they are in Nancy Pelosi's husband's investment portfolio. If that's not a good sign to invest, I don't know what is. It's no secret she's great at picking stocks. When we take a look at the financials, who can blame the Pelosi's though? 
Its current share price is sitting around $53 with a 52 week range between $31 and $57. The year to date return is over 29% and it's had a five year total return of over 34%. Also, the dividend yield is sitting around 6.7% and they've never missed a dividend distribution. AB has been consistently beating earnings and even though the share price is on the higher end of its 52 week range, many analysts are still giving it a buy rating. If they can sustain growth and continue producing awesome dividend yields, this Pelosi pick is worth checking out. Young investors have a new strategy, tracking the financial disclosures of members of Congress for stock tips. Our list continues with another investment company, Fidus Investment Corp, ticker FDUS. Fidus provides financing solutions to lower middle market companies, usually owner operated, with revenues between five to 50 million. Now for the juicy part, the dividend yield. It's over 7% for the year, and they've never missed a dividend payout since they started 10 years ago. The year-to-date return on the stock is over 50%, and they have a five-year total return of over 88%. The financials look strong with a trailing 12-month earnings per share of 390, and a very low price to earnings of 4.73. Although it isn't backed by any politicians that we know of, Fidus looks good on paper. It has excellent growth, efficiency, and a very reasonable share price of just over $18. They continue to beat earnings and many analysts have them listed as a strong buy. Are they a boring company? Absolutely. But the numbers don't lie and we think this could be a solid investment. Our next stock, Hercules Capital Inc, ticker HTGC, is helping innovators bring their ideas to the market. As a venture capital lender, Hercules has helped fund over 500 companies with more than 12 billion in commitments. Their business model focuses mainly on technology, life science, and sustainable energy. The entry point to this company starts at around $16 per share, and it sits in the middle of its 52 week range of $12 and $18. It's had a great year to date return of over 30% and a five year total return of over 100%, which is 20% a year on average. No big deal. I'm kind of a big deal. Its dividend yield is nothing to ignore either at almost 8% for the year and also hasn't missed a dividend since its first offering. Although their debt ratio and cash flow are of some concern, their profit margins and earnings have been consistently rising and this is another stock that many analysts have as a strong buy. The price to earnings ratio is 6.14 and their earnings per share over the last 12 months is 272. We chalk this one up as another great dividend option to provide quarterly income even if the company loses a bit of steam or trades sideways. That's it. We made it to our last on the list, which is Aries Capital Corp, ticker ARCC. This is yet another business development company offering comprehensive financing to the middle market. This company is yet another solid option if you're looking for return on investment and high dividend yield. Getting into the financials, the share price is right around $20 and has a year to date return of almost 32% with a five year total return of over 109%. Looking at the dividend yield, it's sitting at almost 8% for the year and it hasn't missed a distribution since its first in 2004. They have a low PE ratio of 5.75 and a 12 month trailing earnings of 3.59 per share. They've consistently beat earnings and if we look at their risk factors, they excel in growth, efficiency and solvency. User Mountain Man in Yahoo Finance chat had this to say, ARK makes money, ARK pays great dividends, anything else is BS. And we couldn't agree more. High dividends, high returns, and sound financials, what more can you ask for? A new car! And that's it for our high dividend stocks. Let us know what you think. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. We've got you covered weekly for all things investing. With that said, this guy is Max, and I'm Mike. And we better see you here next week. Coffee? Yeah. Cheers. Cheers.